Mississippi Library, one of the first public research libraries created in the U.S. With many of the books cataloged over 100 years ago, before library science existed, curators literally pulled the books off the shelves to see what they could tell them about the library's origins. What they found was a story of Baltimore's intellectual ambitions. They created almost overnight within a, a period of 10 years a collection of zero books to 25,000, actually much of it during the middle of the American Civil War. The Peabody Library has a little over 300,000 rare books, but the 50 chosen for the exhibit are being called the rarest of the rare. In the collection, this medieval book, Aristotle's Manuscript, a Baltimore man studying in France to be a doctor bought it. He left it to something called the Baltimore Athenaeum uh, in 1834. In the next year, the Baltimore Athenaeum burned to the ground, but somebody had the presence of mind to grab this medieval manuscript and throw it out of a window. It was collected by Brantz Meyer in a gutter in the street. Then there's this 18th century silk embroidered pillow. Upon which the foot of Saint Anne, the mother of the Blessed Virgin Mary, was placed for a period of time in the Cathedral Church of Ancona in Italy and attached to it is actually a printed piece of paper with a wax seal on it filled out in manuscript indicating that it is an indulgence that allows one's loved ones to spend less time in purgatory. Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News.